Hello, my name is Joe Murray. I'm a gastroenterologist here at the Mayo Clinic in Rochester. And I'm talking today about a paper published last year uh, about liver involvement in celiac disease. We know celiac disease primarily affects the small intestine. That's basically where gluten gets digested and then the immune response to gluten damages the intestine. But it can affect other organs. And this paper by Anani et al. in the World Journal of Gastroenterology really describes in exquisite detail the types of liver involvement that occur in celiac disease. For example, it's common both in adults and children to see abnormal liver blood tests that are really a sign of irritation of the liver. But there are also more serious problems, what's called celiac hepatitis, where celiac disease can cause quite substantial irritation or inflammation of the liver. Beyond that, there's also the possibility of associated disorders. That is, people have a genetic predisposition to celiac disease, also may have a genetic predisposition to other autoimmune disease. Autoimmune hepatitis is one, and also primary biliary cirrhosis. So we need to be aware that celiac disease doesn't just affect, affect the small intestine, but can affect other organs, in particular the liver. So when seeing a patient with abnormal liver blood tests, even if they have no history of celiac disease, consider that among the possible causes of those abnormalities. Thank you.